Hey everyone, it's Kay, and welcome back to another vlog which covers my June experiences. I intend to keep things short for this vlog since I gave you longer vlogs from before. I appreciate you taking great time in watching them, and I hope that in one way or another, you were able to take some impactful insights from it. Now, as I'm about to share my June 2022 vlog, don't forget to give my video its well-deserved thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. June was mostly devoted to law school. It was the month of final exams. Most of our second SEM courses finally gave their final requirements and all others. It was this month that I had to sacrifice some important engagements so that I could cater to what I need to focus on. And that did not go so well. Aside from focusing on the exams, rough waters were experienced by me as to relationships with the people closest to my heart. Though not really romantic, but I mean, I kind of lay low from this relationships, I must say friendships and all others, that I did not know what to do. And these are people who are really closest to my heart. It was hard to make them understand what should go first for now. Really, really hard. And it went to a point that I had to be distant and to reflect properly and to just process everything well. My emotions were challenged every day, and it was too difficult when things were okay for a moment and then the other misunderstandings happen once again. Oh well, maybe life is really like that. You cannot have it all at once. I would not dive much to the details though, but the occurrences deeply challenged me, and often it made me question my capabilities in almost everything. Nevertheless, when all the other things happen, in this portion of the vlog, I'm sharing to you what else was dealt with in June. When all else fail, it was this one portion in my life that always reminded me that, hey, you can. You're doing great things, just keep going, and that is actually law school. When all the other aspects in my life seem to fail, this journey keeps reminding me to keep going, and that I'm always grateful for it. I am reminded for the purpose that I have, and entering law school was actually a dream in itself, and living it day by day is the prize that I'm willing to always take. It's not that easy though, it's not an easy schooling at all, though but you know, living up to it is what makes my day in every week, in every month, extra exciting. vlog ending June today. It's June 30 and I am doing my final review for my last set of exams for the school year, I hope. Um, oral exam siya, so medyo kabada ako because I'll be the first one in line. And anyway, pasado o hindi, okay lang sa akin. I mean, I did my very best and I have invested so much of my time here. So, yun. I will just take this at my own risk and all of that. Anyway, may pinagandaan din naman ako. Ayan, yun. So, I just really look forward to ending June today kasi ang dami yung nangyari talaga. As you can see from the previous vlog, um, emotionally, physically, uh, mentally, lahat-lahat. So, I just want this month to end and I can't wait for it to end through this exam. So, yun. And, uh, I hope you have enjoyed the portions of the vlog and yun. I'm really just so happy na kahit despite everything matatapos na. Hey vlog! So, I'm just waiting for the time. It's now 6.35 and my schedule for the exam is 7 p.m. to 7.10. So, I'm looking forward that I'm gonna finish this already tonight. Sagad na. So, yeah. I just wanna end it and I'm excited. No matter what happens, I know I did my best and um, 
nothing would ever stop me from reaching the goal and ginawa ko gagawin kong best ko and I did my part in the review and whatnot so whatever comes out I will I will accept it so yeah turn on your camera now yes would, would you like to start ah uh, okay <laughs> yeah we still have five minutes but anyway five minutes or seven o'clock it's just the same Okay, and just right on time. Uh, your 10 minutes is already fast. But anyway, you were able to answer it substantially. You just forgot to mention, of course, the skeleton workforce or the skeletal workforce that is uh, being required, especially this is an industry of public interest. It's a hospital, right? Okay, okay but yes. good enough. You mentioned, about, you mentioned about the Secretary of Labor taking jurisdiction or assuming jurisdiction over these uh, cases uh, that has been the reason of the strike because indeed if it's a hospital or any other industries of public interest the secretary of labor will immediately assume jurisdiction yes. within 24 hours okay good job oh, you yeah. got yeah. i give you a full credit to that <laughs> yeah. not bad. thank you <laughs> not bad enough thank you very much you and for... see you next year inshallah thank you for Next year. <laughs> yes, okay, bye bye. Take care. And in this portion, let me share some valuable moments that I've also spent. Even though I was feeling sad, I was confused, I was too emotional, and all in between. I will always be grateful for these times. I mean, it was spent with the people also closest to my heart, those who tried to really listen well, and, you know, just being spontaneous at some point. And what can you say? Okay, I am going to eat the <laughs> nose of Kitty. This is the nose of Kitty. But you have a complaint ah. about it easily. But the Hello Kitty <laughs> experience stroke. <laughs> Try to look. <laughs> She's no longer Hello Kitty. <laughs> So someone saying sa Petron ah? Akala ko sa Shell ang true love. Bakit? Sa Petron pala ang true love. Free song? Dito mo lang malalasap ang sarap. <laughs> Nang cotton candy? Ni Kitty! <laughs> Why Runa si Kitty? <laughs> My name is Hello! Hello, hello, hello! My name is Kitty! Kitty, Kitty, Kitty! Hello, hello, hello! Kitty, Kitty, Kitty!
By the end of the month, one thing was deeply valued by me, which greatly impacted the conflicts I have dealt with. That is, communicate as needed. The people involved in your life will not always get what you want to express when you do not speak up. Like I mentioned in my May vlog, they have their lives and problems too. You cannot expect them to solve or answer matters for you. The essence of communicating is what I deeply valued for June. It did not come easy though, but only when we express can others also get our real point or what we really want. Only when we communicate gives way to what has to be understood. Only when we communicate in a very healthy way, I must say, can we mend or fix things as needed. It is always a two-way process also. Well, you speak your point, you listen to the other person, and process it from there. It takes a choice, and communicating is a choice, I must say. Though it's needed, but if you do not wish to communicate, then what's the point? So, in the end, what will be lost when we speak up anyway? Thank you for watching this vlog. I promise to give you the last set for the monthly update in a few days. See you on the next!